All right, welcome back. I'm about to play a different game, game that's also from Cartoon Network, Clarence. Reckless Ramps. Those of you who already forgotten Clarence existed. It's a comedy show of a kid that ends up in trouble and has many adventures with his friends, like Jeff Randall, the kid with a cube-shaped head, and Sumo, the tough a boy who likes to always become like the quite the troublemaker for the serious most of the time. Short crowns can be almost annoying, but still I actually enjoy the show the way it is. So I'm um, actually gonna play one of the games for the first time. So I only played a little bit of this game already. Just a few minutes ago. So you're just basically jumping on ramps and tower your vehicle, which I still can't figure out how it works. Also I like how there's like an uh, angry dog there. And there's that lightning which I swear is like Pikachu's tail. And have to upgrade your vehicle. So probably do this for like maybe a Maybe 16 minutes of a short gameplay. So, this one's pretty easy actually. Just go up, down, um, just for the money, the trophy, white bouncy balls. Kind of reminds me of that weird Via Doll game, in like that. I can't remember what it was called, but it's been a long time. I might review Clarence pretty soon, but for now, let me enjoy this gameplay. So, show me the sign that you're not supposed to crash down over his head, like he's just dead right there. And I just fell down. Oh no. Now he's covered in bandages. Alright, let's try again. And now the game. All right. First one was pretty easy, so the second ones are again a little bit tougher. Perfect. Uh. All right, come on. Well, I drive. Time for a little bit of upgrades. This might help things things up a bit. And get for left. Okay, I have no idea what I just did, but I think I pressed the X button. And I must have trophy there, but still, not have bad. Alright. We're doing good so far. Oh, I don't want to go for those big ramps there. And I missed the money there. Try again. This time I'll use the extend for sure. Whee! Woohoo! Eh, not that bad. Two out of three, I guess. Alright, fun enough, Machacho. And you 
fell down. Try again. Come on. Okay, let's fall down. Alright, got a lightning. Okay, so I think that's like the only time you use it. I'm digging this music. There, not bad. And off I go. I like that for those tires. Down I go. Down again. Boom, boom, boom. I gotta get annoying after a while. And down I go some more. I think I need some help. That costs extra. I don't go with that one. I still got like... You know what? I'm gonna do it for 17 minutes. Because I'm actually enjoying this game. Crap! Okay. That's a few bucks there. Ugh, this is hard. Hard already. I was gonna play the Rebear Bears one, but for some reason it doesn't wanna work. Nope, still can't do it. Damn it! I'm gonna keep doing this for like a couple of minutes. It's gonna be me doing this over and over again, isn't it? What two is better than one, I guess. Somehow I'm gonna screw this up too, aren't I? It's like controlling a real vehicle. Great. I can't move. Great. Yep, it's one of those games that just freeze over. Oops, I'm gonna start playing this for like 16 whole minutes. Or 17 minutes. Yep, there's nothing I can do. Don't you just hate when, like, when you're playing a game and it starts breaking up and it throws up? Alright, let's try the next one. Let's try Awesomeness Battle. I 
kind of hate it when games froze up like that. And perfect. I don't want this video to be too short. It's just perfect. I just started playing Clarence and now they ain't working. Alright, let's try something else. Let's try this Adventure Time. It's been a while since I've played Adventure Time. Let's see. Let's try this one. One Street Row. Eh, <sighs> pray it works. Crap. Well, I guess I'm forced to play this one. Please work, please work, please work, please work. I don't want to cut this video too short. And it's taking too long. Alright, let's try this one. Please work, please work. I'm trying my best to make this gameplay go on longer. I don't know why it always takes me so long for these stupid games to upload. Here we go. No adventure time. Hey, Ice King, why you still are garbage? At least I don't have to hold on to the DF. It's because when I hold it, it just really gives me such a choppy green horse holding it. So, I have to apologize on how long it's taken. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, really? No, screw that. No, screw that noise. I am not going to deal with that. That sounded way too slow. <sighs> Alright, let's see. You know what? Let's try Maybe this one. Crap. We're like three minutes in. Three and a half minutes in, I. I only show you like half of that current game. So let's see. I guess I can try, I don't know, this one. Please work. Please work, please work, please work. I am already getting tired of messing around on here. Now I don't want to work today. Oh, thank God. I know we played this game before already. But you already seen that. What the hell is that? Sound like freaking fireworks going out there. Since your time game, I just hope it goes way too slow and the other ones I don't want to play. <sighs> well, I heard they're going to put, like, Aladdin, Lion King, and the Jungle Book coming out on the freaking on PS4. I don't see why they did not do this in the first place, and the last time they did that, that it was kind of like last year ago, or is it 2019? I don't know. Before my, oh, I had to like change the channel to a bird. 
I try to make sure there will be like enough room for playing like like Aladdin or the Lion King on both Sega Genesis and Super Nintendo. Because on there you, you can actually rewind time. So I'll just play this game for a short amount of while since I've done this all before already. And this is already my seventh and then first video already. I had to replay the same games again because I can't afford to get any newer or different type of games quite yet. Jump on that stupid guard head. Yeah, take that. I do have this game on the Super Nintendo, but I just don't know where it's at right now. I mean, those of you playing like a line on the Super Nintendo before, it is kind of a good game. Alright, come on. Oh, freaking snake. You just attacked me. Even with its quills. I mean, last time I played this game, I did kind of suck at it. Maybe it's the controls are a little bit slippery at times, or I'm just not super video game skilled at this point. Yeah, eat apples. Just a creep. I do know you have to collect enough gems and all that stuff, but I don't have time for this, so... There we go. Those of you playing a land before, trust me, those of you already playing this game, game every year. Um, hold on a second. Um, the basic game plot is kind of like the same as the movie. You're playing a land as a street rat and takes food for survival. Then later on, the film, he meets a beautiful princess, Jasmine, and falls in love. Saves her life and starts to take, take him away and meets an old man that's obviously Jafar and has a final magic lamp and grants him all the wishes. And obviously, what you're seeing right now is the genie who's voiced by the legendary Robin Williams. That's in peace, but still, well, he uses the wish to become a prince and use up all the free wishes. This can send the genie free from his prison. And fall in love and live happily ever after until we get the sequels. But I'll get to talk about Aladdin and the King of Thieves pretty soon. For now, you're seeing me playing this game. So I'm just gonna. I would run past these guys and just get towards the end of the stage as quickly as possible since my video can only last for like 20 minutes when I'm holding up a candle. Yeah, eat apple, you stupid guard. Or who looks like Razu. I mean, if you collect all the gems, you get like a pretty good end, special ending and all that stuff, collect the balls and all that kind of thing, ow, I think there's like a um, speed run to make them go faster, ow, also, I love when a lion says, Whoa! And he takes damage. It's like, Come and get me, you stupid jerk. Everything in this game is all pixelatedly good. For an old game that came out in 1993, and the film came out in 1992. And let me just grab this one up.
and fell down. Well, I didn't want to get the jewels, but whatever. All the levels are kind of based off the movie is pretty well made. It. And they're 20 years later. It still looks pretty darn good. And yep, you can have those enemies responding right back. Also, there's like a cloth that uses like a parachute, which almost makes the entire game a whole breeze. But I'm not gonna do that right away. We're gonna get to the very end of this level, and I'll probably end it here right about now. I'll just go ahead and pause this video because it's only lasts for like 23 minutes. Alright, pause. I said pause. Alright. Hey guys, I'm glad you enjoyed me playing both games, Quarrents and Aladdin. So probably the next game I'll do will not take too long. And hopefully it's going to be something different, something weird, something crazy. So yeah, glad you guys enjoyed my gameplay. So I'll see you all next time. So long for now. And thank you for watching my 701 videos. So long. Farewell. I feel to say thank you all for watching.